How to program your DirecTV remote to your receiver and your television. Don't waste your time with tech support. Let's get started. Make sure that your receiver is powered on. If you're having problems with your receiver, push the red button to reset it. If you don't have a red button, unplug it and wait 20 seconds. Your remote control needs to have adequate batteries. I prefer to use nuclear fusion double A's. They carry an extra kick. <coughs> You will have to push the select and the mute button at the same time and hold them until you see the light blink twice. Now you must enter 961. Push the channel key up and then push enter. The remote will now program your direct TV receiver and it will show ready for our app. If this is helping you out, subscribe to this channel and hit that like button. To get videos that give you strategies to improve your career and your life, hit the dinner bell icon. Now let's program your remote to your TV. Start by pushing the menu button on your remote control. With your arrow keys, scroll down to the settings part of the menu on the left side of your screen. With your right arrow key, scroll over to the right in the settings portion. Click until you see remote control. Now push select. In the bottom of your screen, select pair and program remote. Select change your TV. Now use the arrow keys to scroll to the letters of your brand. Now I select LG. I have a hard time keeping up with all my stormtroopers names, so I select I don't know my model. Most of the time it works with the very first code. If it did not work, scroll down and select try next code. Once the next code is selected, test the volume. If you get the volume, then you can select it work. If you didn't, good luck and go over all your other codes. Make sure that you like it and subscribe to the channel. This is how I feed little Darkie. Does it my boy. Thank you for watching.